hello, hello, hello. Hello, my lovely Sakura Blossoms. Hi, Zypher. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> Hi, everyone. <laughs> hello, hello. I hope you all have an amazing day today. Hello, everyone. Good morning or afternoon. It's more like it. <laughs> I woke up at a reasonable time today. Wow, that's a first. <laughs> Hello, everybody. I hope you all have an amazing day today. We are streaming. Naho, you cutie. Hello, Naho, you as well, you adorable little bean. <laughs> today, I wanted to talk a little bit before we get into uh, other things. Um, first thing, uh, the video, I edited it, it's up on my YouTube channel, and I got caught up, finally, I'm caught up on all of my, uh, VODs for my VOD YouTube channel, if you guys don't know, I have two YouTube channels, one for, like, edited down videos, and one for VODs, so if you haven't checked those out, make sure you guys do, uh, we got a lot of things, uh, that we're gonna talk about, an update, and, uh, updates in the server and stuff, but, um, yeah. But, um, I want to talk to you guys about some stuff that happened today in my life. My God, I tell you, this morning was, pfft, ugh, it was something, I tell you that. This morning, I woke up. Okay, I woke up on the very edge of the bed, and then when I, like, fully woke up, I fell off the bed, and now I have a giant bruise on my back. So my back hurts. <laughs> so that was how I started my day. Literally off the bed. You say it on the wrong side of the bed, but I was literally not even on the bed. So that's how my day started. <laughs> and then and then I was working on some of the website upgrades uh, update. So if you guys don't know, uh, I'm currently creating an entire website for the uh, Winter Solstice SMP, where it will give like perks and like uh, cool things that you will only get in the server that you pay for, and everything that you guys uh, spend there will go towards contributing towards helping out the server and keeping it running and upgrading it. Because right now we're kind of at the we're kind of struggling with the the RAM. I need to upgrade it, and also like I said uh, for the. Um, when we uh, finally do the, uh, what are the words? What are words? Um, the, <laughs> oh my god, I can't think of words. Oh yeah, when we finally do the, uh, when I do the winter thon, when we start the winter thon, everything that we make from the winter thon is gonna go towards upgrading the server RAM. So, uh, because right now it's uh, quite a struggle and uh, I definitely need to uh, put some funding into it, so that's what those uh, money made from that is gonna go towards. I wanna be completely transparent when I say these things. Everything that you guys give me goes towards like more stuff for like streaming upgrades or like um, server upgrades or otherwise, but um, yeah. Uh, we made some major upgrades. We're still not there yet. The website isn't up yet. We're still working on it. I know Mystic has to do the like setup for like the the loot crates or whatever, the loot pack crate things that you will get when you subscribe. Uh, it will be, uh, we have, I'll give you guys a little bit of uh, an idea of what we have. So there are roles that you can buy. We have uh, the first role is VIP. So we have VIP, VIP plus, VIP plus plus, and then MVP. So, depending on, um, what you buy, you'll get better stuff, and, um, yeah. So, uh, we also, I finally finished creating all of the badges for each of them, um, but yes, it's like, just like, you'll get, like, a VIP rank on the Winter Souls SMP Minecraft server, as well as the, uh, VIP Discord role. You'll have access to the rank-only chat, which I'm gonna create soon, um, name on the ranks list posted outside by spawn we will have a ranks list uh i've already kind of started it um and then uh vip monthly and a vip monthly weekly and daily kits 
Um, so that's something that Mystic is still working on. But uh, it's gonna be super exciting. I'm excited for you guys to see it. The I'll show you guys. I think I have them saved. I think I have them saved. So hold on. Let's see. Can I add image? We'll just do this, and I'll post it up here. Let me make sure I'm getting the right photos. So I'll show you guys the badges that I created. Oh Jesus, it is really big. Hold on. Oh jeez, why is it so big? Okay, so here's the... I'm going to make it a little smaller. Just a little bit. So here's the first badge that I created. This is for the regular VIP, so it's kind of like bronzy. Uh, you could think of it as bronze, gold, silver, whatever. Um, the ranks. So here's the VIP rank badge. Isn't it so cute? I love it. It took me a while to get all of them done, but this is the first rank. Hello, Mary. Hello, hello. Welcome on in. Sorry if I was late. No worries. No worries at all. We're currently just uh, discussing uh, the updates that I've done uh, for the website. So I am building an entire website for the Winter Solstice SMP where it has purchasable items that you guys can help keep the server running. And uh, yeah, so uh, I'm just showing off the badges of, um, of everything. I appreciate you being here. So this is our first badge. It's just our bronze badge for VIP, which is our first rank. We have our second one, which I made several versions of, but we finally decided on this one. So this is the VIP plus rank. It's kind of like our silver bells rank. It's super duper cute. I wanted them all to be Christmas themed since uh, it's a Christmas server. So that's our VIP plus. And then we have a huge change with aesthetic with our VIP plus plus rank. Very bright and aesthetically pleasing. But wait till you see the final one, chat. The final one looks even better. Our MVP rank is the highest rank that you guys can get. And look how fucking adorable it is. Oh my gosh. I spent so long with this one. But I love how it turned out. I think it looks so pretty. And it's very, very Christmassy. But um, but yeah. I was just busy doing something. No worries. You're never late. Listen, I appreciate you being here. There's no such a thing as being too late. Thank you for redeeming First Cross. Hello, hello. Welcome on in. I'm showing off our uh, rank badges that I created. Hello. <laughs> the MVP one, I won't even lie, is my favorite badge thus far. Look how fucking pretty that is. It's so gorgeous. I'm so excited for you guys to see the site when it's finally finished. I'll give you guys kind of like, we're still working on the price ranges a little bit, but um, so I wanted to be affordable and uh, still be able to have it contribute to the server. So our first rank, which you guys saw the bronze badge for it, let me pull it up for you guys just so you guys can get a better idea. So our bronze badge rank, this one, the price is going to be $10 once it's not a, the site isn't finished yet, but we're working on it. Oh, no, Mary, it's okay. It's okay. I know. It's a joke between all of us. It's a joke. It's all right. No worries, Mary. I know. I know he doesn't mean it. I might be a little bit stinky. Let me just... Okay, I'm a little bit stinky. I'll admit, I'm a little bit stinky. It's okay, though. It's okay, though. <laughs> So our first rank here is our uh, VIP, which is our first rank, which will be around $10. Uh, that just helps uh, support the server. You get all the perks still. And then we have our VIP plus rank here. And this one's going to be $15. So add another five to the original and you can get better stuff. Um, so that's what we got for the, the next rank. And then the next one after that is our VIP plus plus rank. And this one's going to be $20. So uh, that will further help go towards the server and upgrades and everything. This is a great uh, one. I really, really love the design of this one as well. I've worked really hard on it. And then we have our MVP rank. 
our highest tier rank. And this one will be more expensive. This one here is $30. But that really helps out a shit ton. Um, and also helps pay for like keeping things going. So everything here will help pay to keep things going with the server and upgrading and uh, you know just supporting uh, everyone who's worked really hard on the server so yeah those are the badges the website is not done yet okay the website is not done yet but um we're working on it still anyways I updated the pick I grew of you you did I'll have to take a look at it for sure thank you I appreciate it is it on discord I'm gonna open it right now Oh gosh, I'm still new. But yeah, uh, I've been working on this like all day yesterday pretty much. There's a lot of uh, server updates as well. Um, I have some bad news, unfortunately, everyone. Unfortunately, my entire build of the tavern got burnt down. How it got burnt down, I'm, I have no clue. But all my hard work got burnt to the ground which is tragic but it's okay because uh, Mystic and I worked on the server last night and we're rebuilding everything but um yeah I know how it got burnt what you do how to get burnt do you think it's the stupid like fireplace thing I put in I never lit it so I was very confused on how that got burnt and I'm I keep hearing like fire sounds it got struck by light did it really oh shit okay well fuck that's concerning no you didn't it's just you baka I feel burnt it down I swear to god you're not even in the server so hush I know it looks these stinky yes it is okay uh, we might have a change of plans a little bit now. It's just gonna be a tavern. It's we're not gonna do the um, the inn anymore because that brought a whole nother concern of issues like with player base. Can we trust them? What if their items are stolen? Are they gonna blame us? Blah blah blah. Even though I thought like I could put safety measures in place by saying hey. You know, in the dialogue for the NPC, I said, if you won't want your valuables stolen, put them in the bank. But, again, you know, alas, I don't think that's going to happen. But I have a lot that I want to show you guys upgrade-wise, because um, we've worked really fucking hard on it. Still working hard on it. We might make it just in time for the server opening, which I'm so excited for. It's crazy. I think literally the only people who really, like, it's pretty much me and Mystic at this point. And Mystic's done, like, everything. I'm, I'm not even gonna lie. I feel bad for this man. <laughs> I'm making him do everything. Although I'm, like, trying my best to help. But, um, I'm not the greatest. So today, I think what we're gonna do is I'm gonna show you all the updates. Uh, I think you might want to use stone for the tavern. Uh, so I'll show you what the tavern upgrade looks like. The updated version of it. Um, and I'm gonna show you a lot of things today of what we've done and I discovered something really fucking cool Which will tie into the lore and everything. Hey y'all, thanks for claiming your daily monster. Ooh, ultra watermelon. That's a good one. Oh, you know what? Thank you for the reminder. I gotta do my 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 daily my daily prediction This by himself Holy shit chat so here is spawn. No wonder it took me forever to load in. So this is our ice castle. Still very heavily as you can see in the works. But holy fuck mystic. Oh my gosh. Okay. So we have. Okay. Creates. That's not how. I don't think that's how you spell it. But this is where I guess the display for the website. Once we have the website. But um. Site is fully finished. And uh updated and released uh this is where the display for them will be where you'll be able to claim them and it'll be a show-off area over here art exhibit so this is where the art that you guys make will be shown off uh, as you can see there's just a bunch of torches at the moment to prevent any mob from spawning over here i'm not sure what he's gonna put over here um oh there's a sign over here hold on Oh god, we're lagging a little. Unknown. 
This could probably be an event room, more than likely. I love that. It's looking good, chat. Holy shit, he really went ham. And then over this way, this is uh, our, our credit room, uh, where you can see all the hard people who work on the server. Here's me, the server owner, and a picture of me, and the decor. I made all of these little posters myself. Server co-owner, which is uh, the mod pack, plus the mod pack creator, which is Mystic. He's created basically this, essentially, this entire world, and it looks amazing. Hey, yo, thanks for claiming your daily monster. I appreciate it. We have our server builders who are working very, very hard. Um, we do have one new addition to the team, a Borum. I want to say welcome to them, to the team. Um, so yeah, we have our server builders, which is super cool. Over here we have our server mods, which is uh, only right now Zypher. We will add more as the, in the future. Uh, we have some Christmas tree decor, random NPC, which I don't know why it's there. I think we'll get rid of it at some point because we still don't know why it's there. Uh, we have the server MVPs. So like I said, uh, we will have uh, ranks. And the highest rank is MVP, so this is just showing them the uh, utmost thanks. The top supporters will be announced here, uh, and we'll be adding on to these. These are the newest additions that I've added, along with some decor. Um, but that's what that is. Um, so we have our NPCs on display with Mystic over here sitting. And we have me over here, which is uh, literally me. Uh, there's gonna be two me's. This is the NPC version of me, however. So when you talk to my NPC, oh my god, I'm so laggy. I am so sorry. Yeah, this is why I need to upgrade because it's so bad. So you go down these stairs and we have a pathway that Mystic has built with these cute little Christmassy hedges around. I am so sorry for any lag because there's a lot going on here and you'll understand why in a little bit. And these are our stalls, so you guys can walk through here. And we have our little stall set up. It's so fucking cute. I love it. So over here we have our kitchen shopkeeper and our furniture shopkeeper. You guys can kind of walk around here if you guys want. Seems I don't know if that gap is intentionally there, but it's there. You guys can walk all the way around if you guys wish. We have our baker and our ingredient seller here with some little decor in the back just to show off. It's super cute. They sell items so you can buy things from them which you'll get currency from and uh, from playing and doing quests and stuff. So that's super cool. We have our uh, kitchen furniture shopkeeper, our furniture shopkeeper. Um, think about the fact that it loops on top of... Okay. Yeah, we'll definitely have to fix that then. If it's that bad, I'll have to work on fixing it. But um, look at all the Christmas decor. We have our, our ores and weapons. Shopkeeper, you guys can give her ores and she'll give you money. And it's super cool. And then you guys go over here. We have our banker over here. Uh, we have our banker, Rory. Uh, I had an idea for those who buy um, the uh, packs from the website or those who uh, support the server uh, will get a NPC uh, built after them, even maybe some subscribers, we'll see how we want that to work. But um, we have a banker, so you can give the banker like items to keep safe. Um, and no one else can see it, it's just for you and them. The quest giver, if you want quests, you talk to them. I'll have to add some, uh, but they are repeatable and you guys can do them several times. We will have more eventually, but those are just starting out quests. We have cute little signs all around and very cute decor everywhere. I love how it looks. And then over here is our entryway into the village of the area. So we aren't going to go through with the, um, the inn, but there's some very cute snowman around for decor. I'm not sure why that's there. I, I can't pick it up. Um, well, for some reason I can't seem to pick it up, but we have uh, some of these houses just laying around. They're empty, so we could decorate them uh, eventually with just items, just to make a, it feel more lively here. It was an idea. We could put 
little beds and stuff if you need to stay the night but these are not for you guys to claim we prefer that you guys build your own houses uh somewhere else but these are just like you know for decor reasons um here oh there's a nightmare before christmas little poster look at that it's so cute i love that i don't know what these all these floaty things are but i think maybe decoration broke this one also empty again there's a lot of these little empty houses that we can fill in and kind of make feel a little more lively then you go back down this way we have a lot more over here um ignore all of them they were just uh put there for uh for now we rescued them well some of them not all of them got rescued and i had to program a few more and we kind of just placed them for the time being we have a lot going on around here as you can see a lot more decor this whole place is just feels more lived in look at these cute little santa plushies they're so cute we have another building here we got a lot of buildings around and um this will be its own thing that Mystic will be working on. This is Mystic's little uh, surprise for all of you. But, um, yeah. Uh, bye, have a good stream, but see you later. Alright, take care. Take care, Mary. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. But, um, yeah. Oh, those fuzzy... Oh, yeah, these are probably tinsel. Might be tinsel that's floating around. I'm not sure where they were supposed to be, but I did get a picture from Mystic, so maybe if I look at it, I'll figure it out. This here, this build here is our tavern. So we've decorated, I've decorated in here a little bit, just make it simple, but still have that Christmassy feel. Hey yo, welcome on into the Sakura Blossom Pack. Hello, 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 welcome on in. Thank you for the follow. Uh, we have our little. Yeah, welcome! We have our little kitchen uh, over here where you guys can sit. Uh, you'll be able to sit and you'll talk to the, the, the owner for the um, Snowflake Tavern. So you will uh, learn more if you talk to them. I'll have to upgrade some of the updates, some of them. Uh, some of the, the dialogue, but um, it's like, welcome tavern history welcome to the snowflake tavern this tavern was founded many years ago by my great 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 ancestors it had been passed down through my family for decades this tavern was built on top of an old rundown mine and rumor has it there's still scary monsters down there and some say you can still hear them making noise but no worries it's just an old rumor nothing will hurt you so if you hear any monster noise it's probably just someone playing a prank or just in your head so uh, that's something that we'll uh, get into later on. We'll have to upgrade the bartender. Um, we'll have drinks for sale here, but um, yeah, we will have drinks. Uh, the only problem is uh, we don't have much alcohol. I was like, what if we sold potions? I don't know. It seems kind of odd. I don't know. I'm still trying to figure it out. But um, yes, here we have our chef. They will offer food that you can purchase. And uh, this is our downstairs over tavern. We have lots of seats where you can hang out. And then upstairs, we have a lot of these cute antique little uh, Christmas trees with a lot more seating areas. You guys can sit around and hang out. But um, yeah. Hello, Viper. Hello, hello. How are you? You can sell reskin potions. Ooh, that is true. We could, but I'm, I'm still trying to work it out. But um, this is another big upgrade. You guys explore a little bit around the tavern. Oh, what's this? Some trap doors leading to the underground. Now, this is where things start to get interesting. We have this whole underground area. And it looks fucking amazing once you start exploring it. It looks like it was an old town that was built in here. Like we just built on top of it. And there, I won't like I won't spoil anything. There were a lot of spawners. There were like fucking 20 spawners right in this area. I did get rid of some of them. Uh so I do apologize. I had to. Cause this is the whole reason 
why the lag was unbearable because of this whole area. Yeah, so the lag was unbearable because all of these had spawners. There's still some of them that I did leave, but this whole area, oh my god, it's insane. They're like little, little things that like are weird why they're here. It looks like a whole village underneath was built here and it's so crazy it's really cool but this is funny how this worked out this is just where we spawn it is literally perfect like I know it was totally unintentional that this is how it's gonna be but like it kind of worked out like look how cool that is it looks like it meant it looks like it was meant to be there like maybe this was already like it's the like he said his great 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 ancestors built this place maybe something happened to their town or they were hiding underground or something i don't know maybe we'll work into the lore but yeah that's where that is and it looks so amazing there's so much to explore down there so yeah it's really cool how's it looking chat those are our three so far fan art mary gaming fan art by cypher and the worm art pig crew by uh vian 13 but uh my own take on it isn't that cute and we're gonna ha hopefully have enough to fill this entire room with stuff i think that'd be really cute ah cult of the the worm the worm cult cult of the wormy wormy <laughs> wormy all right, all right, all right, all right. It's looking pretty good. All right, I like it.
thank you all so much for being here. I love you all so much. I love you. Um, 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 I love you all so much. Thank you guys so much for being here. I'll see you all again soon. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.